Hey, this is Joe Bob John here, hey, with my first video in an actual play playlist, Ocarina of Time. Well, I'm gonna be playing Ocarina of Time, and the playlist is gonna be called it. I'll just stop talking. Basically, this game is available here for the Nintendo 64, and where technicalities are concerned, also with the 3DS and obviously the the uh, Wii Virtual Console costs about ten bucks a relatively relatively although it costs twenty bucks a to get a card that allows you to use a thousand credits at least I think that's how much it's worth anyway just watch. The Legend of Zelda, Ocarina of Time. Friggin' awesomeness. <laughs> Alright then, let's go. Look. Just a second, this was my fair recording take. Delete it. Delete. Delete. So, I'm gonna be using the name that I used for that, basically. And this time I'm gonna do it right, no distractions. The reason that it was a failed take was because I couldn't figure out how to cut out sound and stuff, and because of my recording setup, that's an important thing. First off, I'd better copy this file to file 2. Just as a backup. Just in case somebody here just, just utterly fails. In the vast deep forest of Hyrule, long have I served as a guardian spirit. I am known as the Deku Tree. The children of the forest, the Kokiri, live here with me. Each Kokiri has his own her own guardian fairy. I am Morgan Freeman. No, wait, no, I'm the Deku Tree. However, there is one boy who does not have a fairy. And he seems tired. Also, he seems like he's having bad dreams. Ah, oh, chains! The chains! It's so loud! Okay, right, stop. I don't like standing in the rain. Standing in the rain, standing in the oh hey, what is that? Holy crap, who's that? Whoa, whoa, a green person! It's a Martian! Kaboosh. Navi, Navi, where art thou? Come hither. Oh, Nappy the Fairy, listen to my words. The words of me, of Morgan Freeman, I mean the Deku Tree. Dost thou sense it, the climate of evil descending upon this realm? Malevolent forces even now are mustering to attack our land of Hyrule. For so long, the Kokiri Forest, the source of life, has stood as a barrier, deterring outsiders and maintaining the order of the world. But... Before this tremendous evil power, even my power is as nothing. It seems the time has come for the boy without a fairy to begin his journey. The youth whose destiny it is to lead Hyrule to the path of justice and truth. Navi, go now. Enter and obtain the path. Find our young friend and guide him to me. I do not have much time left. Fly, Navi, fly! The fate of the forest, nay, the world, depends upon thee! I am Shakespearean. First person view from he, he, the view of the most annoying he, protagonist in any Legend of Zelda game. I swear, she'll just annoy the heck out of you eventually. 
That guy's trying to pick up a rock, apparently. Or something. There's the house, where's the house? There's the house. Yep. Weep! Need to fly through the great Navi, not into. Through. Hello, Link, wake up. The great Deku tree wants to talk to you. Link, get up. <laughs> hey, come on! Can Nairo's destiny really depend on such a lazy boy? Uh, I'm up, I'm up. Yeesh. Ugh, yawning. Yawns. I have a bad case of the yawns. You finally woke up. I'm Navi the Fairy, and you are a mute. The great Deku Tree asked me here to be your partner from now on. Nice to meet you. The great Deku Tree has summoned you, so let's get going right now. Something that has probably been noticed by uh, by everyone, almost every single protagonist in video games are mute. Um, basic controls, you can press X to... You can... You can... Where's the... Where's the button? Uh, anyway, hey, you can press A to release Navi. You could also press it again to put it away. If, if I had a weapon, I would uh, be able to use it by pressing B if I had a sword. If I had a sword, uh, you can press a uh, plus to go into this menu. Press L and R, not Z and R. Hey, this isn't the end. This isn't the Nintendo 64, you know. Oh wait, it is. Well, who cares? I'm not playing it on the Nintendo 64. Uh, basically, what this is. Let's see. Uh, this is the map of areas. Currently, the only area that we have. Is he is Kokiri Forest and a bunch of clouds and annoying noses. Noses what? And annoying noises. Uh, this is the select item screen. This will become hey, more useful later. This is the equipment screen. You can equip boots, tunics, shields, and swords. Oh jeez, I gave something away. Shoot. Uh, well, if you didn't know that already, like, who would know that? That link gets a shield and sword down. Who cares? If you don't, then you do now. Uh, these things will become more apparent on what they are later. So these, and these, and these, lots of stuff will become clearer later. As, as well as these clowns. Seriously, they got on my nerves. Oh, and also while you're in here, you can press B to save, and if you're in the right thing, you can decide something. A, you can decide something by pressing A. Oh wait, no, it wasn't X. It was up on the up on the right joystick to change point of view. In later areas, I think that it, uh, like if you're crawling through a tunnel, then it does first person view. But anyway, hey, awesome music, and awesome green anime hair with low. Yeah. Low resolution. Yahoo! Hi, Link! Oh. we Ladders are... Yeah. Ladders are people who don't know how to jump down ladders. Wow, a fairy! Finally, a fairy came to you, Link! Wow, that's great news! I'm so happy for you! I have a stereotypical laugh! And a low polygon count! Now that... Uh, now you're a true Kokiri, Link! Is that right? The Great Deku Tree has summoned you? It's quite an honor to talk to the Great Deku Tree. I'll wait for you here. Get going. Go see the Great Deku Tree. You can also press A to, when you're running in this game A to... No, not do a barrel roll, do a forward roll. And this guy, he'll just stand and just hammer time your way. In front of you. Hammer dance. Pretty much. Unless if you... Unless if you do something for him. 
Hey you, Mr. No Fairy. What's your I have a fairy! It's right in front of me. Okay, now it's not. It, it, it hit in my hand, but it was right in front of me. What's your business with the Great Deku Tree? Without a fairy, you're not even a real man. What? You've got a fairy? Say what? The Great Deku Tree actually summoned you? What? Why would he summon you and not the Great Mido? This isn't funny. I don't believe it. You aren't even fully equipped yet. Just talk to my fairy. It'll tell you. How do you think you're going to help the Great Deku Tree without both a sword and a shield ready? What? You're right. I don't have a microphone ready, but if if you want to pass through here, you should at least equip a sword and shield. Sheesh. And if you don't, I'll I'll continue hammer dancing in front of you. Eh. Let me pass. Oh, and also, you can press L to focus the camera in front of you. And... And you can do the hammer dance yourself. But, yeah, pretty much now we have to get a shield and sword. Also, I have a little timer to set for how long I can keep videos till I'm like more experienced and stuff. Thrust attack signs to thrust your sword. Press the left press the left joystick toward your target while Z targeting. Well, L targeting in this game. It's back to Z targeting in the um, in Twilight Princess and and Skyward Sword, I think. But the Virtual Console version, it's L targeting. And in any GameCube, Legend of Zelda games, it's L targeting. And press, and then press B. The, the other sign. Cut grass with your sword. If you, if you just swing with B, you'll cut horizontally. If you hold Z as you, if you hold Z L as you swing, you'll cut vertically. Hole of Z. Let's get through this small hole. Stand in front of the hole hey, and push hey, the left joystick towards it. When the action icon shows enter, press A to crawl into the hole. Pay attention to what the action icon says. And that's closing if it didn't. It's what the A button will do at this moment. First person. Oh, and also, you can toggle the map hey, by down and up on the D-pad. Up makes it appear, down makes it disappear. What's that rumbling noise? Viewpoint to with Z targeting. When you have no object to look at, you can just look forward with Z. Stop moving, then change the direction you are facing, or hold down Z for a little while. It's conduct. You get oriented in the direction you want to face. It's quite convenient. If you hold down Z, you can walk sideways while facing straight ahead. Walking sideways can be very important technique in dungeon corridors. Turn around and try doing this right now. <laughs> 